You know, it's the show that beat Monday Night Raw for 83 consecutive weeks as we welcome you to Monday Nitro. Tonight will truly be the greatest night in the history of our sport. With everything going on lately, we thought we might see him tonight. And the wait is finally over. Here we go. Let's find out. Not making any friends. A fan favorite. what's on his mind and here it comes let's listen in as he addresses the wwe universe Shh. the fans are eating it up Bad blood is a boiling.
They say pride comes before the fall. We shall see. Check that ego at the door. <laughs> Message received, and I, for one, can't wait. Not sure what to say about that, except Let's go. Well, I'm not sure we can top that, but we will do our best as we move along with our program. I look at this card and my mouth starts to water. Triple threat action. We have a great match coming up next. You know the rules. First one to get a pinfall or submission wins. Let the madness begin. It's one of Mexico's top stars, El Mago. And his opponent, first, from Mexico, weighing in at 241 pounds, El Mago. Oh, my Spanish is a little rusty up. Hey, guys, what does El Mago mean? I believe it.
from every man's nightmare, weighing in at 250 pounds, the man known as Sting. And so it begins. Despite triple threats being every man for himself, history has shown that the match's dynamics can create unlikely alliances. A participant must be ready to endure double team attacks at any time. If you haven't hit record yet, now might Ouch. be a good time to do that. These guys are gonna have a match you'll wanna watch over and over again. You've gotta believe this one's over. Ah, step up in Zagari. Rocked him. Oh, chip breaking uppercut. What a stomp. Good grief. Incredible power! Wow, what a vertical suplex! In February of 2017, SmackDown Live was lit thanks to an epic triple threat match for the WWE Championship. Champion Bray Wyatt defended the title against former champions John Cena and AJ Styles. This battle overflowed with mayhem before the match even got underway thanks to Luke Harper attacking his former leader, Bray Wyatt. Standing drop kick. Great ups. It's not often that the WWE Championship is incapacitated before a title defense. John Cena and AJ Styles rekindled the rivalry with a renewed enthusiasm for destroying one another. Bray Wyatt ended the match and made up for lost time as the Eater of Worlds used his body as a weapon. It was pure chaos as AJ Styles followed suit with an unbelievable array of aerial attacks on both superstars. And John Cena continued to fight back in hopes of winning a record-breaking 17th. Got the shoulders down. Yeah, I don't believe that, that he didn't win this match right there. Uh-uh. Point of the elbow, nailed it. When this guy's on, look out. Uh-oh. Hung out to dry. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. He's starting to stagger a bit. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match oh, just as much as he does. I hate to say it, but if he doesn't change his game plan soon, these two guys are going to tear him limb from limb. He's doing exactly what he didn't want to do here. He's letting his opponent right back into this match. There can be so many combustible elements in a triple threat match. A superstar must keep in mind the no countout stipulation can mean that the match is going to be fought Jeez. in every possible location. Oh my. With a power driver. You have to like his chances here. Back in the ring again. We've witnessed on a number of occasions the personal issues between competitors forcing the match to overflow into the crowd, up the ramp, or in the locker room. In a triple threat, there are no countouts. You notice El Mago's going slam. I'm not sure how much he has left. Oh boy, he is whooping. Senton connects. Nice. Shut it down. Oh, nasty impact. He's moving with confidence now, guys. Bulldog! But he's got to capitalize now. Sting him with a scorpion death drop. That has got to be it. Can he do it here? Two, 
Oh, it's over. What a triple threat match. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. These superstars didn't exactly set the world on fire, but this match had its moments, as we see here. I've got to be honest with you. I'm kind of glad that match is over. He comes out with a W, but it wasn't very pretty. Here is your winner, the man known as Steve. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card unfold. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. Buckle up, because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. It'll be Los Pariquas against the four horsemen. These four superstars are ready to roll, and so am I. to the ring at a combined weight of 388 pounds the luchador pedro el numero uno and ray fingers los boricuas Combined weight of 336 pounds, Kyle and Stan Marge, the four horsemen. And we're now underway with this huge tag oh. team match. Got the uh -oh. oh my goodness, crushing it! Oh, and a snap there! That'll give you a whiplash. What a stomp! Good grief! Why 
wisely bringing the action back into the ring. Boom! Boom! Oh, a knee right to the face! Looks like he's starting to sweat now. Ooh. His tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. I think a lot of people right now are scratching their heads wondering how he let this match get so out of hand. Boom! <laughs> Inside the ring now. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history book. Uh-oh, pump handle applied. What's coming next? Ooh, what impact. But he's got to capitalize now. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination. Looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won't be nailed. I'm not sure how much he has left. He won Harsh impact. Can he finish the job? Now he's got something working. Good night. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, he's such a tough target. Oh, a knee right to the face. That knee is a lethal weapon. Tagged in. more of this he can take. He needs to find a way to create some space or else this thing's over. He's in a bad spot here, Cole. It's absolutely vital that he get to his corner and make the tag. Otherwise, this match is over. There's no way to sugarcoat this one. He's getting absolutely destroyed right Ouch. now. Bonnie dodges out of the way. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE locker room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think it's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon might want to consider. Gets out of the way of that one. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. Man. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Kurt Monsoon. Look at this. Oh, boy. Ooh. He is rolling. Easily kicks out of that one. Still in it. What's going to happen here? No, so no, don't do this. Oh, gosh. Sunset foot power bomb. Back between the ropes. Slam down hard. What a comeback. He could pin his opponent right here. Two. Ref found a two count. Clearly not enough damage done. He's looking, oh, nasty impact. Nice. Shut it down. You gotta believe this one's over. What's he gonna do now? And there's his speed paying off.
Super kick. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. He's taking some offense. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. It looks to me like he's really trying to carry this team on his back, which really isn't necessary considering he has a very capable partner he can tag in with. And here we go now. Ooh. Nailed it. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Wow, talk about knowing where you're at at all times. He's stumbling some now. And at this point, how much more does he have to give? At this point, they both look to be about evenly matched. Maybe I'd give him an edge, but not by much. Dodges that one. Look out, guys! Oh, what impact! We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. Oh, impactful slam! <laughs> oh my god, whipping pile driver spiked. Nobody does it quite like him. There's the cover. Can he do it? Oh, ouch. Devastating elbow. Oh boy, he is rolling. Looking for the finish. I don't think he should get up. Inverted DDT. But can he follow up here? There may be no coming back from that slam, Cole. Keep your eye on this one. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. He's in trouble. We've seen this before. Reverses that one. Not the off. Oh, what impact. Oh, boy, he is rolling. This is going to be big one way or another. Beautiful technique. Tagged in. The longer this fight goes on, the more wear and tear on each competitor. Who is going to have enough to pick up the win? Wow, I thought he would have gone. Slip blade! Nicely done. Drop down. Drop kick. He's going for it all. Look at this. He goes for the cover. Two. Just before three. That was real close. Uh-uh. Oh my, oh boy, he is rolling. Harsh impact. Ooh, there's the kick. Second rope. Oh, he'll Panama Sunrise. Is that enough for the win? 
Yeah, I don't believe that, that he didn't win this match right there. Wow, that's pure power, guys. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Not good for the back and body. Oof. But he's got to capitalize now. Taking out the arm, great strategy. That has got to be it. There's a pin now. All the way up and around the world. And that's it. This one is over. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. That's the kind of match that makes me proud to be here at ringside. Action from the opening bell and a finish people won't soon forget. He's going to want to make sure he saves every minute of this match for his personal highlight reel Here because he was on winners, fire in this one. The Luchador, Pedro, El Numero Uno, and Ray Fingers, Los Boricuas. What a grueling match. It looked like anybody's match there toward the end. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date. Taking on some tough competition. You don't want to miss it. We got a camera backstage, and it looks like this is going to head to blows. What a stomp. Good grief. Ugh. Hooked up. Oh, nice belly to back. That could be a game changer. You got to believe this one's over. Uh, oh. Where are they going now? Oh, nasty impact. Oh, the old European uppercut. Uh. Bulldog. Here it is. He looks a bit off his game here, but not for a second do I expect him to back down now. Who doesn't love when a fight breaks out in the back? I mean, other than you, Saxton. Mr. Goody Two-Shoes over here likes to keep it in the ring. Whatever. We see more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in it. Oh boy, he is rolling. I think we know what this is. To leave a mark permanently. Here's his chance to win this. I don't think he's left strike. This just might be enough for him to take the victory here. And the action continues to spill backstage. He's not looking like himself here. He's really going to need to create some space for himself. It doesn't get any easier when you're backstage, and it looks like he's finding that out the tough way. If his opponent somehow wins this thing, we could likely go back to this moment as the turning point of the match. Oh, he turns it around. Whoa! Uh-oh. Oh, an elbow 
elbow drop. He's making a statement here with this attack. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. No, he reverses it. Ooh-wee. A second time. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Up next is the long-awaited championship match. We have one of our breakout talents versus a formidable opponent. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the AWA Extreme Heavyweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Pong. Introducing the champion from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 225 pounds, he is the AWA Extreme Heavyweight Champion, John. Stay right where you are, people. As we get underway, I'm expecting a hard-fought match between these two superstars. The first one to make a mistake could fail. And it looks to me like this entire arena is on its feet, and understandably so. 
see a great opportunity here for the challenger who can't afford to make any mistakes here tonight not when you're in the ring with a champion as dominant as this one he's got him covered and an early kick out in this unusual matchup too early in the match to end it too quick for him there To follow up Byron's earlier point, the challenger has to remember just how rare championship opportunities truly are here in WWE. A loss here could result in a trip to the back of the line. Don't worry, Cole. This isn't the challenger's first rodeo. Everybody knows exactly what's at stake here. Oh, what impact. The challenger's taking on some offense. But he certainly oh, comes man. into this championship match with a ton of momentum. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring. Oh, man. Believe it or not, fellas, some people are speculating whether the champ should have to defend the gold against what some are calling inferior competition here tonight. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Look at this! Nailed it. I'm not sure how much he has left. Did you hear the sound their bodies made upon impact? Wow. Here he goes. Corey, I think you're just trying to drum up controversy. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. What's he going to do now? Drop like a bad habit. Boom! <laughs> and if he hits this, this one's over. Ooh, but he's got to capitalize now. He's on a rampage now. Not sure how long this will last, but he's fired up right now. He wants to do this in the ring. Ring rattling. I know anything is a great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. And there's his speed paying off. Penny predicament. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Not yet. Too early. And Ambrose is rolling now, Michael. Leg drop! The champ looking absolutely defeated right now. Byron, I agree that the champ comes into tonight with a great deal of momentum. Uh, I think this is the beginning of the end. He misses the dive. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. Butterfly DDT. Now it's time to capital. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Three. Yes. Unreal performance. Now let's take a look back at these guys in action. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Here is your win. 
Honor, and still, AWA Extreme Heavyweight. What's this? Well, I think it's about to be a highlight reel. Back in from the floor. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. No, there he is. Oh, 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 what a response. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. And now, one more time. Oh, and a butterfly DDT! Nicely done! That might have done it, Cole. Making her way to the ring from Athens, Greece, the Princess Anna. And her opponent. From the edge of reality, the AWA Extreme Wrestling Women's Champion, the Outlaw Suzuki Saturn. Michael Cole, Corey Graves, Myron Saxton here to call what will surely be a highly contested matchup. Popped up, Meteora. She goes for the cover. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. Not too early for that. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, what a kick. Oh, from behind. She goes for the cover. Plenty of fight left. Uh-uh. What a strike. Right on the mark. Drop down. Oh, 
suicide dive. Breakneck speed, one of her Karana. She's starting to feel it. To be expected, though, given the competition she's in there with tonight. Well, she certainly seems to favor being outside the ring. Though, for the life of me, I cannot figure out oh. why. Look at the look in her eyes. Man. She's in the zone now. Popped up. Meteora. She's playing with fire here. Yeah, she's got to hurry up and get back in there. Incoming. Drops her. That was about as in your face as it gets. Six. And she turns it around on her. Six. Gotta get back in the ring. We might just have a count out on our hands, Cole. Eight. Uh oh, pump handle applied. What's coming next? Beautiful technique. Victory is on the horizon. That should do it, Cole. There's no coming back from the slam of that. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. I remember this part very well. And finally... Here is your winner, the outlaw, Suzuki Saturn. And that's a win to start off the night. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed it.